Hi guys, welcome to K World. Let's talk about the recently released drama The Glory. I have just finished this drama and I will be telling you the positive and negative aspects of drama so you can decide whether to give you your time to this one or not. The Netflix origin series The Glory Part 1 was released last December with total number of 8 episodes which gain a huge attention not just in South Korea but worldwide. The drama main plot was around a former victim of school violence seeks revenge on her bullies after taking a job as a homeroom teacher at the elementary school of the bully's child discussing the positive aspects of drama number 1 undergoing the major physical appearance of the cast these physical changes were seen in the cast member that just made them more real and connected to the storyline the character dongun has gone through so much pain in her life to make it seems perfect on screen song haekyo did an amazing job with her physical transformation which made her cold and strong to carry such character she does a, did an fantastic job and not just her the other cast member by just looking at their old uh, real life images or old pictures and the character played by them you can definitely tell the major differences they have went through to just fit in this character and i just love number second considering their appearance they did give and mind blowing performance each and every character just blend with the storyline by so far what surprised me the most was the song haekyo performance she was well known for her romantic and melodrama drama acting style but she really did an fantastic acting for this dark and a cold character there was lo- not a single moment where she let her character be down she carried it with full grace and she just nailed it Number 3 the supporting cast how can we forget the supporting cast many of one reason the series became super hit was the perfect casting of character from the young version to the adult one whether it's lim jing yoon as park yo jin shin ye yoon as young park yo jin both of them portrayed their part perfectly both of them were not seen in negative character big four but they did made me hate them so much from start to end which made them amazingly perfect for the drama also how can we forget uh, yum hae ran as kan yo nam a housekeeper who worked at the home of semyong foundation president she along with her daughter suffered from domestic violence uh, to by her husband she helped dong uh, dong yun in the later revenge by becoming her partner in exchange for the killing of her husband the partner in crime pair was just blissful to see the chemistry and character development was so amazing and there were just few scenes in which both of them i, I really laughed aloud and their chemistry was something different i, I just cannot explain i really loved the pairing of them together by so far these two were my favorite supporting cast now let's talk about the negative aspects of drama Season two being a bit long, I really feel felt like season two was a bit long as compared to season one. I mean the story line was really amazing. For me, season two could have been finished in six episode than eight. At some point, it got slow and should have done in less episode. As from season one, there was a perfect drip and speed maintained. which made people curious what's going to happen next but in season 2 some episode really made me feel the length of the ap- episode number second revenge be not to satisfy i was really expecting more intense revenge scene dongun has taken her revenge but i felt like those all were done in an indirect way and she was not personally involved she was just uh, indirectly that does not made me such much satisfied overall as revenge was taken which matters at last so i am not also sad about it but i felt like it should have been more revengeful i hope i just felt like that next i really feel like less screen time in season 2 was given to Uh, Jung Sung Il as Han Do Young, Yu Yeon Jin's husband. He was one of the leading character in season one, and many of many people were expecting to see more of him in season two. But 
they really gave him real, very less screen time and which made me really disappointed i was really expecting more parts of him in season 2 okay coming on to next should you give your time to this one i would say yes definitely you should give it a try the glory is really well written and performed it was if if you are someone who wanted to watch something intense and thrilled revengeful this is, and if you love to explore different content uh, and different uh, genre of k drama you can just give it a try it's really amazing overall i really enjoyed the series i would give it a 8 out of 10 let me know what are your views in the comment section and how much would you rate out of 10 so that's the video guys hope you enjoyed it you can follow me on my instagram handle where i give daily k drama content updates so do like the video subscribe to the channel share with your friends and yep see you in next video guys bye